Welcome to Cuck Me Curbs Coding Class. Today, I'm going to show you how to change your browser's scroll bar with CSS. It's really easy. So, scroll bar normally looks like this. You know, it's a little bar that you scroll with. So, I'm going to show you how to change what it looks like. It's really easy. To get started, pop open your text editor or whatever you prefer to use to write HTML. Okay, here's my text editor. And since this is CSS, open a style tag. All right, now we've got our style tag open, just write colon colon dash webkit dash scroll bar. And this is how we change the scroll bar. And width colon 20px, that's so that it will show, and it's gonna be 20 pixels wide. We can fix that later if you wanna change the width. You can do that. One time I made it as wide as my entire screen. It was really weird. And then write colon colon dash webkit colon not colon dash scroll bar and make sure you spell scroll bar right because I just spelled it wrong. Scroll bar. Now I spelled it right. Dash thumb. And the thumb is this thing let me show you back on Google this thing I'm moving right now which you drag around to scroll that's the thumb and that's what I'm gonna be changing in this video you can change other stuff too alright I'm gonna close this tab I don't need it anymore back to the text editor and open curly braces and I'm just gonna make it green I'm not gonna change anything else about it so background I spelled background wrong, there we go. Colon green, semicolon, and close curly braces and close that style tag, you don't need it anymore. That's all the CSS you're gonna need. I'm gonna add some lower mips, some text, so I have something to scroll through. Awesome. That's it, save it. I'm going to call it scroll bar, bar.html. And I'm going to put it in this folder. Save. Awesome. Now, pop open your file manager, find where you saved it, and drag the file right into your browser. That simple. And oh no, it looks like I did something wrong. So I'll close this file manager, go back to the code, and let's find out what I did wrong. Oh, I forgot to open the curly braces after typing scroll bar thumb. Whoops! All right, let's save that again. Go back to the browser and reload the page. There it is. See this thing? That's our scroll bar. So you can use it to scroll. It's very nice. Um, you can do a lot with it. I'm going to see what happens if I make it 200 pixels wide. Save that. Refresh the page in the browser. And now our scroll bar is really crazy wide. So I'm going to put it to 10 pixels. Save that. Reload in the browser. And I like I like the size. It's kind of small, but you can still see it. It's there. And I'm going to see if I can make this an image background. Like, I have no idea if you can actually do this. So let's find out. Let me just go to Google now so I can grab an image. Let's see. I'm gonna grab the Oogle logo. Um, copy image address and close this tab because I don't need it anymore. Go back to the text editor and then change the word green to URL open parentheses and then in quotes paste in the image and then close quotes and close parentheses and save. I have no clue if this is going to work, but I really hope it does. Reload the page. And it, well, it kind of worked. Because um, the background of the image is white. So you can't actually see the scroll bar against the black, I mean the white background. So that's interesting. I'm going to make it. 
200 pixels wide, just so you can see the actual image. Save, and then reload in the browser. And now you still can't see the image, but the scroll bar is there. It's super weird. I kind of like this. It's like the invisible scroll bar, and if you happen to click there, well, you get to scroll. Super weird, super weird. That was a very interesting experiment. Hmm. I wonder what happens if I get rid of that. I might fix it. Let's try reloading. I think it didn't find the image. Well, no, it seems to have found the image just fine. I don't know. That was interesting. Let's see what happens if we make the body background black. Uh, no, P background black. P. Open curly braces. Background. Colon black. This is a very interesting experiment. I like this. And close those curly braces. Save the file. Reopen your browser. And, well, that was weird. Okay. Cool. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And just so you know, this own does not work in Firefox or Internet Explorer or Microsoft Edge. But that's why I'm using Chrome. And not Firefox, which I would normally use. But I'm not using it. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out Kidzee in the bottom right corner of this video. And leave a comment requesting something to do for the next video. I really... It's hard to think up these ideas. So help me by doing a tiny bit of the thinking for yourself. And... That'll help. Well, I don't have anything for you to remember. So remember to buy my merch at cogmicurb.gq slash shop. I almost forgot.